Welcome back to California Oaks. Last time we discussed deciduous trees, which include valley and blue oak, and also evergreen, which includes the interior live oak and the coast live oak. We talked about the lobes of the, the valley oak, the wax of the blue oak, the diversity of the interior live oak, and the hairy armpits of the coast live oak. The Central Valley is in the middle of California, and the, our capital, Sacramento, is in the center of that. The Valley Oak is found in the valley, but also towards the coast. And on either side of the valley, on one side we have the Sierras, and on the other side we have the coast ranges, and in the middle of that is the San Francisco Bay Area. And the Blue Oak pretty much is at where those two regions meet, at the edges of the Central Valley. And the interior live oak is found all over that, and the coast live oak is found along the coast. So there are many spots where multiple species are found. You might be wondering about the far corner on the bottom. That's the desert, and that's where the desert scrub oak is. And again, the scrubby oaks are not really trees, they're more like bushes. So let's ignore that. Uh, today I'm going to focus on this middle area halfway between San Francisco and Sacramento, which is connected by the freeway, there is a city called Fairfield, and that's where today's video takes place. I visited Rockville Hills Park, which cost $3 to visit, mostly full of mountain bikers, but you can hike there too. And it's right at the edge of the Central Valley. Really, it's in the coast ranges, so you, see, you can see blue oak and you can start to see coastline oak. This is just to supplement the video that I uploaded earlier this month. Most of the footage in those videos were from summer and fall when everything's dry and drought-like conditions. This is spring. It, this is what California looks like in spring. Este video is para um, complementar el video que puse más temprano. Es este mes. Muchas de las fotos e imágenes en ese video estaban de verano y otoño. Así que todo se veía muy seco, pero ahora que es primavera, hay flores y todo se ve mucho más verde. Um, todavía se puede distinguir los robles vivos, es decir, el encino. Este es un encino y aquí tenemos un roble azul que está empezando a ojear. So I just wanted to point out that even in spring you can kind of distinguish. This is, for example, um, uh, a deciduous oak that is leafing out over here that's what the blue oak looks like and over here this is a live oak but it's too far for me to tell if it's coastal or interior thank you